Have you spoken to any of the families of his victims? We've spoken to several, but there was only one that we've become very close friends with, the sister of one of the victims. And to this day, we remain good friends with her. If those families are watching this now on television, is there anything you want to say to them, either from you or on Jeff's behalf? Well, I'm extremely, very, very sorry that it happened to their loved ones. And if I could have done anything to prevent it, I would have. And I ask, would ask them to forgive Jeff for what he did. Uh, he's paid the price, I believe, now. That doesn't lessen their hurt, but uh, ask their forgiveness. Like, like Teresa said to me, Lionel, I forgive. When he was murdered, Teresa said to me, Lionel, I forgive Jeff. Do you forgive him? Yeah, I forgive him now. I mean, um, it's really horrible to think of, to try to keep thinking of all the things he did. But uh, even though he did all these horrible things, we forgive St. Paul for all the people that he killed in the name of God, in the name of Judaism. He, he was forgiven completely. And so if God can forgive, which is demonstrated in the scriptures, if, if God can certainly forgive St. Paul, I, the teaching is, of course, that anyone can be forgiven. Joel's reaction to that? For me, that's a very hard uh, way to answer that. Forgiveness to me has different levels. Um, stuff that <clears throat> he did <clears throat> consume me that probably fueled my, uh, my alcohol and my drug use. But that said, forgiveness is not for so much the individuals for myself. So to answer your question, no, I don't forgive him, but I don't hate him, if that makes any sense. Mm -hmm. I hate what he did, but it doesn't consume my life anymore because I was basically, you know, locked in that. I, it's hard to explain. Maybe you could help me. Uh, Dr. Phil, if you know what I'm saying, I don't forgive him, but I, you know, because the hatred, if I still hated him, I'm hurting myself. It's like fire is a good tool, but it, it, if it's unchecked, it burns out of control. So I would have burned myself out. Billy, what do, what do you say? That makes sense. I'm going to say no. And I'm going to say because it keeps going, a generation's what, 20, 30 years, lost a son lost a wife. My family goes through hell all the time. And it, it, you know, when I was in therapy before my doctor passed away in 2008, you know, part of the therapy was to be able to get rid of these conflicts, you know, with the anger, the uh, being able to forgive, you know, and stuff like that. But I, I'm not so sure I can forgive him. Do you have a story or a question for me? Click the link in the description and tell me what in the world is going on.